Okay. <laughs> really tasty. Mm. Thank you, David. Very soft and creamy mm. beer. Very good. Thank you so much. Hello. Yeah, hello, David. Hello. Guess what I brought in? Huh? So this is uh, hanma. So it's a soft classic lager from Korea. Yeah, sounds so, interesting, yeah. Right? Yes. So this is an upgraded version, and we're gonna have it for dinner. I thought. Wow. Yes. So this uh, Hanmak here is going to be available in uh, convenience stores and marts and uh, restaurants and bars from March 27th. It's a traditional uh, golden emblem which looks like uh, rice. And the white color like so foam, beer foam, kind of meth. You see these beer glasses here? These are like specifically designed for this Hanmak beer. So you can see the beautiful long shape kind of makes it look nice for the for the taste. It tastes nicer when you like drink it through this. And it narrows up here as you get to the top, so it like makes the, the foam more dense and it lasts for longer, the foam. It sounds very good, huh? I usually, when I have beer, it's just a very ordinary, boring yeah. shape. But I, I actually mm. love this shape. Yeah. I'm gonna drink yeah. from this a lot. It's cool mm. when you think about a design like this. It's yeah. nice. Yeah. It's yeah. nice to hold too in your mm. hand, right? Yeah. So let's, let's get drinking. Yes. Mm. Uh, now we wait 10 seconds? Yes. Nice. Beautiful. Mm. Oh, it looks very soft. Yeah, it looks so creamy. Yeah. <laughs> it looks really soft. It looks mm. creamy. So there's like two ways to drink this one. First, you can just uh, drink down the foam. Very soft foam, mm -hmm. yeah. So, and then you can also drink it. Mm. It's amazing. Nice. Mm. Soft. Mm. <laughs> Very good. Okay. Chan. 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 I can't believe how, how soft and creamy this beer. Beer from foam is so soft and smooth to drink. So the beer you're tasting now, they made of like 100% domestic Korean high quality lines, so you can feel the, the foam is much tastier. Um, and the foam is good. Uh, yes, it's thanks to the Korean rice. This foam mm. is like the foam lasts 20 seconds, oh, yeah. so it's longer than other beers because this brand is from Obi Mekju. They have 70 years brewing techniques, skills, so they have some know-how so they can have 20 seconds lasting foam. So that's why you can taste it now so and long lasting foam. I think it's it's like as a lager beer, it's a good beer. I feel like I feel it's uh, maybe like more soft than some of the yes, ones we really got. and good. You're good with this. And good. <laughs> Swedish guys don't need say too many things but if they say it's good, it means it's really good. Oh yeah. It was a good uh, thing with this narrow glass. It really made it really tasty. I love oh. holding it. This is just yeah. the feeling of holding it up. You get a big a feeling like you're drinking from a big jug up here. While mm. as like down here it's still... <coughs> Maybe it's this long. Uh, it makes the taste to stay longer because the glass is long. I don't know. It's good. I think we get in a good mood with this beer. I think so Thank too. you. Thank you Thank for you. bringing really? it home, yeah. David. Mm. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, you got done pretty fast with your beer. Yeah, I was too good. Would you like another one? Yeah, sure. Oh, Perfect. yeah. Nice. Then, boom. Whoa, look at that. Wow, that's a fluffy one right there. Hold on, I have to taste. Really tasty. Mm. I think this is my kind of beer. I've only seen this, uh, try this um, sparkling light lager in, in Korea. But this is a very smooth and, and uh, creamy, soft. I think it's best I've tasted in, in Korea. I think this could be a bestseller in uh, all of, uh, over the world. I think so too. Yeah. 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 Woo! Oh, cheers! <laughs> okay. When we are in Korea, we, I think we could take this beer outside. And public. Have yeah. it in the public. Okay. Yeah, it's That's allowed to sit outside too. Yeah. Mm. It's, but it's not in Sweden. No? no. I think if yeah, if you're in a city, you might they might take your beer. 
Yeah, yeah. but he, then it's good. You can go outside and together mm. yeah. and sit outside in public I, and I, have a good beer. I, I've had that case happen to my friends before when we were walking around in town in Sweden. The police just come up and they're just like, oh, Do they take, you. take you for mm. those. And uh, they're not in trouble. They just no, take their beer and pour yeah, it they, they, But oh. here, I guess you'll get away with it. Just, yeah, just but I think it could be cozy if you're sitting down in a, in a park. You know, in and this you house, in the, a, in, in the first floor, you have like a perfect yeah. spot to sit. You have the outside, a glass, in glass, mm. you know, mm -hmm. glass space. Nice. And mm. It would probably mm. be here. Yeah. And then you can just buy it in a supermarket. Yeah, here you can buy it in a yeah. supermarket. Yeah. Yes. Sweden, there are only special stores right. where you can buy it, mm. controlled by government. Yeah. Yeah. So it's very restricted. Yeah. Here you get it 24-7 mm. too. Hand okay. so you go to uh, convenience stores, supermarkets or anything. Another combat. Another combat. Cheers. Of course. Cheers. But if, if you go out in a bar <coughs> in Sweden, then it's crazy. You, you probably have to pay a lot for one of these in the bar. Mm. Yeah, probably it, ten it, bucks. It's ten bucks, ten dollar. But but if, in, if you go to these special stores, it's not crazy expensive. The difference is in Sweden, it's a, it's like an organized like method you do to even get your drinks. In here, if you want a beer, you go get a beer. Mm. It's like you you even sometimes you go to the convenience store. It's like oh, that's a nice beer. I wonder what that tastes like. You, you could you, you, you could you maybe say that. It's good that you can have, you can buy your beer at the same time as you buy your food in mm. here. Because yeah. at home I need to have special time for special stores. Yes, yes, and that's annoying. Mm. Here, here you go to E-Mart, you, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. you would go to a big you, you should, supermarket. Yeah, you can say yeah. that's <laughs> and then, it's con yeah. It's convenient, yeah. if you want us to say. You go to a big supermarket and there, if you say you want to get chicken, we're gonna get, you know, I want, it's, I want very, to have... it's pretty convenient. You can give the take the food and together with some nice beer. Mm. It's very convenient. But in Sweden, you need <coughs> to go first for the food, and then you have to to go to the store to buy special store for uh, for mm. buying a beer, which is yeah, it's not as convenient. Of course. I think like one difference I I notice with the uh, like drinking culture is in Sweden, you go to a bar, everyone's super casual there. Yeah, okay. You take a beer and you cheer. In uh, here. I think it's a much more strict. If I go to with my company to drink alcohol, I usually I should turn away. First of all, like I should hold two hands. I should be like polite when I cheer with you. I should also mm. turn away from like if there's an older man next to me, I should turn away from him. But I'm kind of kind of stuck here. In now. this case, mm. but yeah. But, but now you you can do as you do at home. Okay. Then, only then we'll it. just cheers and then mm. just cheer like, like this, yeah. and then we'll, we'll and we're just equal drink it. For yeah. Drinking. We are just. I can drink. I can show him the bottom of this barrel. No problem. No problem. Is that not okay in Korea? Nope. Show in the bottom? He said he should, should actually ah, okay. turn, yeah. turn around. Yeah. I'm not sure. Thank you, David. Uh, very soft and creamy mm. beer. So easy to drink too. And I'm still not full. It's very good. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs>